good afternoon everybody. It has been storming and raining all day. And just now is the best bit of the whole day. Got a nice low sun, beautiful park to walk through on the way to the shop because the dogs have decided to eat all of our bread. And I've got to go and get some bread. Uh, feeling very blessed this afternoon. Look at it. Look at that. Tree. Shark, yeah. um, I'm going to do, try and do a manta ray. There's a seal. Found a fish. Just dropped under there. Tired boy, go look at that wonk on your face, Tove. Did you put a mummy and make her sleepy? Mummy, mm. mummy, tell me, get up. Good. Good morning everybody, it's been a bit of a while since I've done any filming, I've been, uh, I don't know, kind of busy but also kind of not, I've had the usual stuff on, the D&D uh, &D and uh, some other bits and bobs, but um, 
I've been reading a lot. I've been reading the uh, final book in the Siege of Terror, The End and the Death. Uh, I've read part one and I'm on part two as we speak. Yeah, I haven't been... I haven't been doing very much, so it's not been much to film. Even though I did go and try out what the Red Wing Gallery was like, or what was happening in the Red Wing Gallery, uh, and it was pretty, I don't know, uh, unimpressive, shall we say, to say the least. Uh, the same artworks pretty much were on the wall that were there from the last time we were there, and that was several years ago. Um, the place was uninviting, poorly laid out, and the charisma was uh, at a low. Didn't feel welcome, even though there was a lovely open fire, which they should make a feature of, in my opinion. Um, yeah, it wasn't great. Then we met with Dan, had a great time with Dan, and Dan cheered us all. Uh, or rather, we cheered each other, and we were ripping it out of each other quite a lot, as we always do. Bye, cat. I got some new boots, some new sort of army boot things. My other ones were squeaking so much it was driving me insane. Yulin is a very cat place. More cats. More cats. Another one down there, hiding in the shrubs. Yeah. I've been trying to walk into work on the days that I don't get a lift from my volunteer. Getting the bus home, but walking in to kind of give myself a bit more exercise and stay in contact with the rest of humanity and not just be doing the shuttle to and fro the nine to five. With the fog that's in, I'm not getting much of a view today. Yeah, wonder why the lifeboats are. Maybe they're just doing practice. That's the kind of morning we got this morning. A nice, cool one, but it is spring-like, and Toby's got his leg cuddled up. Come on, Tom, lift that leg. There we go. Finally got him untangled. Uh, yeah, I've got both boys with me. They're doing their uh, morning wee-wees and pupus. Oh, it's Pox. Now you have to stand right in that puddle. Hmm. Of course he has to stand right in the only puddle. So, it's a Monday and I'm off to work. And I'm looking forward to it. Had a great day yesterday to celebrate dear Lou's birthday. Ooh, woofer. Not mine. Not my woofers. Come on. Oh, my dog has to tie me up in knots. <coughs> Sorry, as I was trying to say before, I was rudely interrupted by woofing. Um, yeah, had a great day yesterday out for Lou's birthday. It was very delayed. Um, it was her 11th birthday. Um, she's a leap year baby. Um, we went to an escape room, which I've never done before. Uh, that was cool. Uh, we needed some hints, we weren't so smart. The uh, puzzles didn't directly link to one another, which was what we were struggling with. Uh, we didn't know which colour coded bit worked with what colour coded whatever. So. Uh, it would have been the most complex Dungeons and Dragons puzzle ever, I imagine. 
if I'd loosed that on, if I'd loosed that puzzle if I had loosed that puzzle on the out of the cold lot yeah the whole of L might have cracked into then I spent the afternoon uh, just chilling and painting minis so I've had my frog world caught on the go for ages I did love doing the builds and then I didn't really enjoy the painting but I had to really get in to the painting which is for me it's getting it's the getting started always with everything getting started on stuff so there's always a barrier like oh can't we go and change my water oh I haven't got this paint oh I haven't got that and uh, yeah I'll make a thousand in my mind excuses but yesterday I just went come on do it and I do do so now they're finished what are you guys doing in this field not normally in here along with the bins <laughs> hmm not supposed not sure you're supposed to be here yes his friend pops his big friend come on Here they are all together, looking very froggy. A beautiful boot boot this morning. It does feel like spring might be finally here. Uh, I'm up nice and early. My manager is coming in to see me today. We'll see the shop, I think. I don't really know. It's unclear as to what I'm doing with him today. Um, yeah. So I'm going in nice and early, so that's why the sun is so low. Uh, should be quite a good day. I got my days wrong this week and muddled myself up. Messed up a D and D game, which means I messed up a D and D game for next week as well because I got my days wrong. Because my brain is so rubbish with dates. Oh, I can't get this under my belt. I really have. Good morning, everyone, or good afternoon, early afternoon. We've had our creative play. And now we are scratching through mud. Addy, if you keep to the side, it's easier. Go to the right. That's it. And then go forward. It's very boggy today. Oh dear. So squelchy. Yeah. Don't know if you can make him out this video just about there there is a seal bobbing in the water good morning everybody it's lovely it's sunny this video is going to be quite a long one i imagine i'm very broken up uh yeah i had a bit of a downer again as my mental health goes up and down and back and forth and um yeah, it's good though today. The sun is beautiful. Absolutely gorgeous near in harbour. Fishermen sorting out their nets. <laughs> 